transportation and it gets me where I want to go. I probably have been using the transit for about a year and a half now. It got me close enough to a place where I could get my computer or fixed when it broke. It got me to where I was volunteering. It got me to a friend's birthday party. It gets me to stores. It gets me to the library. It gets me everywhere. Walmart and Sumter and there's an interesting story as to how we got there. Stephanie and I decided to go to the Sumter Mall today to investigate the seven different routes that the Santee Water Re has. Well, in coming back we accidentally got on the Shaw shuttle instead of the Broad Street bus that we needed to. So the driver was kind enough to drop us off at the stop she knew that we could use to pick up the express back to Columbia which is really awesome. I see this happen a lot in the system that I work for in Columbia. So um, it's really neat to know that everywhere you go using um, public transit, if there's a way to transfer to get to your destination, the drivers tend to know what those transfer points are and usually coordinate to make that happen. provides our downtown circulators such as the purple and green route but they also have campus routes that um, accommodate those students that are coming here to um, meet their schooling needs and um, they have a route in St. Matthews as well that circulates. Um, this service is actually provided with the help of the Santee Watery Regional Transit Authority. It covers um, Kershaw County as well going through Lugoff and Camden and also has a fixed route system in Sumter as well as express routes back and forth to Columbia. You'll see that this transit system is very, very nicely equipped. You can tell that it's just new and it's fresh. The only thing different about ours is that we typically don't have to turn anybody down, so we don't have to screen the people. Uh, I can't remember what the process is called, but we typically can take anybody who needs to go. Okay. Their, you know, their originating address has to be in Newberry County. Okay. Um, we also do the Medicaid contract, the non-emergency medical contract. We have a bus that travels around, kind of a, it's more, it is kind of a little fixed route. Oh, and so they, they got the seniors in there. And so we've transported about 20 people, 15 to 20 a day. We come through the seniors. Express bus started back in either 06 or 07. And at that point, it was funded only by state dollars. They wanted to see what, if you know, people would be interested in the commuter route. Um, this route started from Newberry, Little Mountain, Chapin. 